Creating lofted features, the Curves tab, Operation Area, Sections Area, and the Output Area. Here I have three different sketches on three different work planes. And now I'm going to go up and I'm going to go to the loft in the Create panel. When I go there, I'm going to select on a section to add. So I'm going to pick on this circle. And now I'm going to, if you notice over here in the operations, I have new solid. I can only create a new solid in the beginning step. Now I'm going to go and add another section. I'll pick on this square. You can see that it, it lofts the item. It builds a green arrow pointing in the direction of the sections uh, from your first to the second selection. My output is a solid, not a surface. I want a solid. I'll say OK. It's created a loft over here. A loft goes from one geometry to another geometry, blends two different geometries. Let's go up and do the loft again. Now, I'm going to go over and pick this section over here. I'm going to pick on this section right here. And I'm going to pick on this section right here. And you can see the green arrows pointing in the loft direction. Now I have more choices available in my operations. I can join, which is what I'm going to do, which is going to join this lofted section onto the previous loft. And I could cut it. Cut it is removing material that are common to both the loft and the material. And I could also use the intersection, which is only going to create an object that is a material common to both to the loft and the model material. But I'm going to join it. And so when I join it, boom, I've created that loft. You can see I do have a loft over here, right? If I come over here and want to delete the first loft that I made, you can see that it says, oh, you have to delete the dependent sketches and features. So this part is dependent on that part. So it really is joined together. So here we have created a, a loft feature, and we use the different operations such as join, cut, intersection, and new solid, and we chose the different sections, and the outputs are either solid or its surfaces, and you should use a solid.